So I always tell people that Drake's a very dedicated individual. Obviously, that's played out athletically and, and through football. But it doesn't really matter what he's doing. He's, he's going to give 100% focus and intensity. He's always looking out for somebody else on top of the long list of things that he wants to accomplish. The kid loves, he loves hard, he loves deep. Whether it be uh, his family, his friends, he's intensely loyal. We want our players to be well-rounded academically. You gotta embody student athlete. And when I think of an elite student athlete, I think of Drake Bowen. My parents have put in me that school is really important. They say you're a student athlete and the student part is going to come first. You know, you're always one hit away or if something goes wrong to need in that degree more than you need in the sport. And it makes me incredibly proud that he bought into it. I started playing football and baseball when I was about four. I really had no uh, say in it. It was, we're going to start football. And like, OK, I'm going to be a football mom. We tried wrestling, too. That didn't last very long. It just kind of baseball and football stuck. I uh, first saw a clip of Drake when he was in eighth grade uh, playing running back. And yeah, he was an absolute load. I remember seeing that clip and saying to myself, man, this kid is, is going to be pretty special. My freshman year, I came in. I didn't really lift all that much. I was just, I was kind of skinny. We just looked at a freshman picture of him. And we thought he was big then and small, probably half the size he is now. Our uh, lifting program has been the same since day one as a freshman. It really focuses on getting those high reps at the beginning and finishing the set with low reps. And we're doing 455 reps by the end of the, end of the whole workout. His work ethic is, is really unparalleled to anything I've seen. The things that he does in addition to what a normal high school athlete would do. You know, he, of course he shows up for weights and he does all of the lifts, but the intensity by which he does it is, is different. Yeah, he looks like a created player in Madden. I mean, he is just every bit of about 6'2", 6'3", 230 pounds. I think part of his greatness is not being a linebacker, running back. I think what it is is that Drake is a great football player. The mentality of just going out there winning, wanting to win, wanting to be the best on the field, that's always been there. We always say that, you know, Drake's so docile and kind and quiet off the field, but between the lines is we sometimes question, like, that's our kid. If there's anything that's said about Drake, it's he plays like his hair's on fire. And those are things you can't coach. I've, I've always had that mental edge, and so that has just made me just keep grinding to be the best and keep grinding to want to win um, and keep grinding to achieve my dream. He's going to be a dual sport athlete at Notre Dame, um, football and baseball. We were walking off a of, off of field at Pop Warner and I asked him what wouldn't you like best or what was he going to do and he just told me, he said, I'm going to do both of them. I said, well, you're going to do both of them how? He said, both of them in college and then, of course, he's going to do both of them as a pro. It's extremely difficult. I, I wasn't worried about him playing both sports. I was more concerned with how do you manage the time to play both sports. You don't see that very often with, with high school kids that, that are so extremely dedicated to their craft um, that they're willing to do things that a, a large majority of high school kids are not going to do. I think Drake is a, a very special student athlete. I think Notre Dame is getting the exact kind of kid that they recruit, you know, somebody who's going to be great in the classroom, great on the football field, and great in the community. The history they have there of two-sport athletes is not like many other schools. That was really my one of my overall biggest factors that made me choose them. I've always wanted to be All-American. It's something that I've always watched on TV every year that it came out since I was probably eight years old. Seeing these guys that are the elite of the elite of the elite that then I get to watch on Saturdays was always something that was really, really cool to me. And when he, he said, yeah, I'm, you know, I'm playing in the All-American game, and it was, it was almost nonchalant, and I go, wait, 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 what? You're not even thinking that when they're young. You know, when you see them, you just see the hungry eyes and everything. So playing in the All-American game, oh, wow, that's, that's so beautiful for them. For all the hard work you put in, all the sacrifices, everything that he's done, I think that that is just a, a huge accomplishment for him, saying, hey, you know, everything I've done has, has been worth it. You'll know when he's on that field. You will see his presence. You will feel his presence. And if it's four plays or 40 in the All-American game, you're going to know who Drake Bowen is by the end of the night.